Okay, I'm back. Three hours and seven minutes, eight minutes, ten minutes, ten minutes. Later. I'm ready. Where was I? Right. Alright everyone, as you all know, we've successfully exposed Infinity LTD's botched human trials and murder for hire through SSNN. The public is demanding their leadership, namely Lucas Drexler, face trial. And he's probably writing his resignation as we speak. Ryujin will be launching a statement, but I believe now is the perfect time to acquire Infinity LTD. Believe it or not, I agree. The acquisition has risks, and it's going to create a lot of work for all of us. But the overall payoff will be worth it. Legal ramifications are a certainty, but the benefits far outweigh the disadvantages. Arguments? Infinity LTD could be the Pandora's box of financial and legal risks. I simply cannot support an acquisition. I think what we're all overlooking is what led us to this situation to begin with. Yes, our security was compromised. But considering Dalton was hired by Masako, the issue obviously starts at the top. In fact, I propose that Masako be removed from CEO altogether. Ularu, this isn't a line you want to cross. And considering you're the mole, if anyone's going to be removed from power, it's going to be you. Hold up. Are you saying you lied to us? Dalton, the last meeting we had, you distinctly said Imogene was the mole, and she'd been dealt with. Do you even have any proof to back up this outrageous claim? Of course we do. The malicious code you hid on this slate to upload incriminating evidence against Masako onto Lucas Drexler's computer. To put it bluntly, Ularu, you're fired. Security will hold you in your office until a proper exit interview can be done. This isn't right. I should at least have the opportunity to resign. And allow you to still be marketable to a competitor? I don't think so. This may be news to me, and I will be reviewing the evidence closely. But this isn't something you just get to walk away from. Security, escort Miss Chen to her office and see that she stays put. You'll regret this, all of you. I believe the only regret would be trusting you to begin with. All right, back to business. All in favor of acquiring Infinity LTD? Aye. Aye. All against? Nay. Good. Alexis, start drawing up the necessary documentation. Anyone have anything else they'd like to bring up? The internal NeuroAmp is a key component of Ryujin Industries' success for the next 10 years. All of those were like, no. Why I hate the thing and the thing's good, but like, I want the universe to happen in this game. More fun that way. Well. Agreed. We all experienced the threat posed to this company firsthand. The security risks would be innumerable. Very well. All in favor of <clears throat> playing both sides, man. Aye. All against? Nay. Nay. We'll start up discussions on how to handle Project Dominion in the future. In the meantime, <laughs> at least the only person to have one is our own operative. Internal NeuroAmp research will continue. The dangers have been noted. And don't worry, 
I'm certain between Alexis and Genevieve, any legal or moral issues will be taken care of by the time it goes to market. Any other matters to bring forth? None? This concludes our order of business for today. You don't want this dude having mind control, man. I'm telling you. <laughs> so, Infinity LTD learned a lesson the hard way, and we exposed the traitor among us. You've proven yourself to be quite the asset here at Ryujin. Give me on desk now. Lyndon and I already had that conversation, and yes, you will be getting an increase in wages from now on. Ooh, I can get a stinking shack in the middle of nowhere. The work you put into exposing Ularu. No operative has ever had to investigate our own to the extent that you did. I can imagine it may have been a lot of pressure, considering you were fairly new at the time. It's been like seven hours I've been here, so. Assistant does. But seriously, taking Ularu down was the best thing that's come out of this. My thought exactly. Imogene's instincts were right about you. Now, as promised, I have your bonus. I hope you'll find it appropriate for all you've done. And I'm promoting you to senior operative. You've more than earned it. It's well deserved. As for the details, I think someone back on the operations floor would prefer to explain those to you. Time's right. I know you're gonna talk to this thinking Cora. I'm working on it, dude. <laughs> I understand. Just chill for a hot minute. I gotta go find Emojin. This deal could be huge for my company. Let me get this feet fixed, man, for a lot I've done. certainly shaken things up around here. I still can't believe Ularu tried to frame me. An obvious misjudgment on my part. But now that's all in the past. It's time to get back to your typical day-to-day. -day. And I'd say it's good to be back if I hadn't returned to a mountain of paperwork. Now, since you are new, you've been dealing with people, but most of our assignments are generated on the mission board. The board holds any available assignments that our techs have pieced together, and I've approved. Okay, missions I'll never do. No, but try to see that as an improvement, since I certainly do. The mission board is more efficient for both of us. Good. The mission board is generally self-explanatory anyway. With your promotion, you've earned yourself an office, so whenever you're ready, you can find your own personal mission board inside. And the best perk of them all, you're free to make your own hours. Oh, and uh, congratulations, of course. You certainly will. Go check out the board, and if you have any questions, I suppose I can start up an open door policy just for you. Hope you're staying out of trouble. It's a relief. I'll take my desk job over being on the run any day. I was lucky enough to have plenty of connections and favors to abuse in my situation. We'll see how many of those favors come back to haunt me later. We're office.
Done this already, man. Chat. I'd appreciate it when you're It'll happen, just calm down. Let me talk to Joseph. Why is he walking? Oh, now I remember what this guy was. What can Reliant Medical do for you? You aren't looking well at all. Perhaps you'd better sit down. Fantastic. That'll really help out around here. Thanks for everything. These supplies will be put to good use. Here, take this. I threw in a bit extra for you. Since you really came through for me. Welcome, off world Unique, original. Can you please mark the mission I wanted to, the main mission I came here for? Right? Maybe he's down low? Let me go over here first. We'll do my shift. Speak with me only if you have what it takes to do tracker work. If you come to talk about bounty hunting, I can answer questions. If you want to pick up, be warned though. If you think this work is for making a quick credit, you may not be. During the war, we had these things called the battle scrolls. I didn't fight in the war, Master. You. I just used them. Yeah, you. You really quit. I usually just did. I'd be making a fortune if I had let our officials know. Do we have an armor room? We do. <clears throat> it wasn't a sigh out of, like, bored or anything, or because I'm a, a fed up, it was just a sigh that was kind of just exaggerated. And overly, overly acted on, uh, when the time's right, I'd appreciate a chat. Uh, you make it through is a big breath. Breath. Move it. I can't talk now or I'm going to be late for my shift. Assembly complete. Craft one batch. One minute starting now. Move it, Sam. Need that raise, brother. Assembly complete. Craft one batch. One minute starting now. Amazing. Hey, 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 hey. Subpar performance pay out. I even found one that's fine. 
Oh, Where are the drugs, Robbie? Is. Nice to see you again. Oh no, I happen to transmit some coordinates to you. My bad. I wonder what's over. Th Not so loud. What are you talking about? Let's keep this relationship simple. Was that sincere? Thanks. Uh, you too. Walter. Put this smack all the way, Walter. I was gonna do some Isaac, but like, you know, I got pulled away for three hours today after going live. So, Isaac, you know, we'll, we'll do Isaac before Saga tomorrow. Walter. Sure, that's the direction you want me to go? And I'll go over here. Industrial chemicals of every kind, but they still can't get rid of the odor of chasm mass. We need to stop by the Stroud Ekblom offices. There are certain authorization procedures when large funds are being transferred, even for something like this. Chef school, this ain't exactly where I saw myself. What is you see security interrogated spaces will claim that mattress is fast and it's just showing up too, so we're fine. Must confess, the hum of a grab drive makes me feel alive. One second, one second. One second. It's all right. I just need to have a short chat with my counterpart. Is she in today? Yes. Uh, allow me to bust you in, sir. You know, Mr. Stroud, you are so lucky. Walter. Issa. Shall we continue from last time? The luxury cruise line market is completely outside of our core competencies. Investing into it is a mistake. No, I'm here about... Wait a minute. A mistake... Our ship designers are the best in the settled systems. 
They design personal craft and military ships, Walter. Large-scale accommodations and hospitality is a completely different beast. Oh, I'm so sorry. Here I am, arguing with my partner. <laughs> and you're just standing right here. Issa Eklund, the hyphenated Eklund in our glorious company's branding. Why isn't it called Eklund Stroud, huh? Oh, aren't you lovely? Walter, wherever did you meet your new friend? I'm jealous. A colleague from Constellation. Ah, yes. The daring explorers my partner is so infatuated with. <laughs> you should hear him reciting that speech. <clears throat> There's no need to go into that. <laughs> oh, my heart skips a beat when he does it. Really, it does. Such passion. If he talked to the board that way. I wouldn't need to placate them so much. I know. It's my favorite hobby. Now, why are you here, my dear? The board meeting isn't for a while, and our vacations aren't coming up either. It's the discretionary fund, Issa. I need all of it. Ugh. This wouldn't have anything to do with that meeting you've set up at the Astro Lounge, would it? I never said that. Did you have an agent hack into my files again? Only after you had one hack into mine. Tell me, can mutual distrust lead to a point where it's actually the same as mutual trust? Oh, don't mind the two of us. Challenging each other intellectually is a cornerstone of our relationship. Now I must point out the obvious. The Astro Lounge. It's a remarkably insecure location. That was the point. Neutral territory in the open. With no leverage. Oh, you must let me help. It's been too long. I have this all taken care of. Some investigation into the cellar. What's motivating them? Then, some preliminary casing of the Astral Lounge for security flaws. Give you the advantage if things go wrong. Bribe a few bouncers, alter the codes on the doors. Yes, exactly. I hate being selfish, but I would like some time with my husband. We need to go through the fund authorizations anyway. James Newell is the broker who knows our cellar. He'll be able to help you find out more about them. And it shouldn't be hard to find the Astral Lounge. Here, let me at least give you some operation funds since I won't be joining you. Meet me back here. Yeah, I'm going to be present for the negotiation. I'm not leaving you to the Neon Sharks, I promise. Oh, I missed you. I missed you too. Do you anything back in your office? For this, talk to my secretary if you need something. Piece of work. How's that feel, huh? What? I'm working here. Can't talk. I've got a deadline coming up. And I much rather want my. We should set up more people Why moving. bother? If they want to tear themselves to shreds, let them. Can we get a moment? Can we talk? I get it, Sam. It'll happen. Just wait. Go and get yourself a drink. It's time to party. We have plenty of Aurora on hand for your enjoyment. Ah, you're new here, aren't you? Name's Boone Morgan, your new best friend on Neon. If you're here for a drink or listen to the music, I've got you covered. But if you're here for something a little more exciting, 
We have plenty of Aurora for sale. Oh, we have plenty of that. But why not try something different? New planet, new city, new experiences. It's what life's all about. The peer pressure. Let's take a look at the menu. Now, I'm not going to lie. The Aurora is a bit expensive, but <laughs> let's face it. Hey, commission, brother. Price on pleasure. Excellent choice. The Sky Suite offers luxury and sophistication you won't find anywhere else in the settled systems. And since you'll be living in the same tower as the Astral Lounge, all of its pleasures and pageantry are only an elevator away. Well, of course, the Sky Suite features an open design with an emphasis on luxury. What Listen, my parents have an apartment on New Atlantis. Doesn't pay. It doesn't even, it even get near it, man. A full view of the city's splendor. How unfortunate! But I will be here should you change your mind. The Astral Lounge is one of the safest places in all of Neon. Security is handpicked from the finest officers in the city. I'm afraid that would be a serious fire hazard. And I think it's only fair to warn you that the network security on our doors is state of the art. Then I would say you'd be interested in the Astro Lounge VIP package. For a reasonable fee, our security can be your security. We do strive for setting. I'd pay it, but I'll like doing persuasion. Mr. Stroud is coming to the Astral Lounge. <laughs> now that is interesting. Well, I think we can certainly offer a discounted rate for you, if you were still interested. Excellent. Let me just apply that discount we discussed and done. We do hope your meeting goes to your satisfaction. Hope to see you again. Okay. Hello. Okay. Hello. Nothing like some Aurora to take the edge. Nothing like some Aurora to take the edge. Got a problem? You talking to me? Installed, actually. Any more digi picks? Hope you find the uh, good stuff on there. Uh, when the time's right, I'd appreciate a chat. <sighs> Hi, good to see you. Are you a merchant? Welcome to no. the trade tower, the pride of Bayville. So you can do your banking your own way, on your own time. Gal banking, where your credit's worth for you. Another zoning meeting at the Sarah Room. Enjoy your cup. Right now. Back off. That's an order, not a suggestion. Back off. That's an order. Not a suggestion. I'm looking for some more digi picks, personally. Exquisite goods.
You need to make room where you can. Come back soon. You never know what we have for sale. You never know what we have for sale. Are you the 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 you're enhanced? No 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 no. We've been here an hour already. Do you sell anything? Like veggie picks? Different you. We welcomed you. If you're tired of our state of the art for a small screwed up. You all really don't know. If you're looking for a new you, I'm always ready to help. If you're looking for a new you, I'm always ready to help. You're just a hotel, that's right. Seek hurt. Joining the merchants alive, you won't find a Always happy to take. It's interesting, but only I need you. Kinetics isn't the only game. Help yourself. Always keep plenty of ammo and stuff. Unlawful behavior. We don't need that to be a I'm still behind on my goods has a full line of equipment and accessories. Feel like making a purchase today? Of course. Watch your back out there. Yeah, we should be good. What was I doing? The seller, which is you. We're fully stocked and ready to sell. Maybe I did. Maybe I didn't. You were homies. Information isn't. New intel. Enough already. Try it. Eh. Had a freelancer trail. Sorry, I tried to threaten the guy for once in my life. He had the upper hand. Oh, like a house of cards, dude. He's embodied out there in that floor. Go home and cry about it for the next four and a half months. 
Think about it in the shower, how badly that dude manhandled me. My hands bloody. Is that a toilet chair? There's a toilet? Okay, never mind. Is everything ready? Excellent. Good work. Let's head to the Astral Lounge. Goodbye, my dear. See you at the next board meeting? Oh, I'll be keeping an eye on this little operation. Just in case. Good luck, all of you. Didn't even leave the elevator. I'll see him down there. I don't know what the seller looks like, but they'll have a security briefcase with them, larger than normal, big enough to hold the artifact. We should split up. The code phrase to identify yourself as the buyer is Ramsey and Travers. Are they? Hm. Standard operating procedure for business on Neon. Cloak and dagger's par for the course. Remember, Ramsey and Travers. We'll meet back near the elevator. Can you get a moment? Can we talk? <laughs> hey there. Hey! You wanna dance? You good? Yeah? The music is amazing! Finally. Hey! Be enjoy no yourself! The cellar wearing a Slayton Aerospace Service pin. You're doing Constellation proud. This Aurora stuff, it's blowing my mind. Hi, having fun? I just need a minute. I think that last drink was stronger than I thought. That's what you said two drinks ago. Maybe you should slow down. Yeah. Probably time to officially split the water. <laughs> Hell yeah! This is awesome! The music's so good. Hell of a party, right? A 
I don't see what the big deal is. It's all legal. What a great night! Come on, dance! Go crazy! Take it easy. <laughs> this place is insane. I can't hear myself. Can you believe this place? <laughs> hey there. This is amazing. What? I can't hear you. Huh? You have to speak <laughs> up. Hi. Live it up. I think when they go into their idle animation, they put their briefcase away. So people in like an idle animation don't have their briefcase out. Or there you were here. What is it? Can't you see I'm busy drinking? Oh, really? I heard you all have a meeting in a few minutes, don't you? In one of those fancy VIP lounges? Speaking of which, I gotta get going myself. Tommy's in the there? I just saw our cellar walk by. That's not surprising. This is a deal over stolen property, after all. Anything could go wrong. Now, before we head in there, let me go over the ground rules. <clears throat> He'll ask for twice what we agreed on. That's normal. He'll probably try to walk out. That's normal, too. Don't worry about the amount we actually settle on. The Stroud Eklund Discretionary Fund is just a chip to you and me. Our goal is to get him to accept that chip in exchange for the artifact. Anything goes as long as it's in our hands, and we're not dead. How does that sound? I can get it for free, probably. This will be fun. I find matching wits with the Neon Underworld to always be invigorating. See you up there. So you're Stroud. You look different in person. I have a seat. Our public relations always insists on doing some touch-ups for the official photos. Embarrassing, really. Your security here going to stand or sit for this little meeting, making me nervous. So polite. Almost makes me forget what planet I'm on. I wanted this to begin with, to begin with, man. Am I to assume that briefcase has our item of interest? Yeah, here it is. Well, look at that. One of a kind, and I know you want it. I have the amount we agreed on. Uh-uh. Things have changed. I want double. Now, how am I supposed to do that? I don't know. But your security here seems to have some fancy gear. Why don't they chip in? Not my problem. It is if you leave empty-handed. We came here in good faith. Now honor our previous agreement. You either figure out a way to give me what I want. What the? Security! As you can see, we're in control. Take advantage of our generosity. Take the money. All right. Okay. It's all yours. Hope I never see any of you people ever again. We have it. The 
This couldn't have gone better. Well done. Some high pressure tactics, but we got what we were after. Time to go home. Shall we? After you, Walter. Shall we head home? Remember. You're after me, Walter. Home. Stop right there. You're in possession of Slayton Aerospace property. Ah. Slayton must have been the original owner. We don't need to do this. All's fair on Neon. Am I right? Hand over Mr. Slayton's property. Now. It's my employer's property. That's all I need to know. You're gonna make me shoot. I'm listening. Not happening. Look, I'd like to help. I'm glad you want to. I'm trying to be reasonable here. Huh. All right. But Nicholas Slayton isn't a man you want after you. It smells like that, man. Good luck with that. Sending on men into the Astral Lounge. Slayton must be serious about getting the artifact back. We better get off the planet quickly. Well, Asa, something's gone wrong, hasn't it? Slayton has put a bounty on your heads. He's squeezed a few palms. Your ship's been impounded at the spaceport. There goes our way out. The CEO of Slayton Aerospace. They're a systems manufacturer. Engines, thrusters... Yes, yes, I'm fully aware this has not gone according to plan. Slayton Aerospace has offices here in the Trade Tower. If Nicholas is moving this quickly, he must be there or close by. Let's go to the lobby, shall we? See if we can make an appointment. Heads real roll there, Walter. Uh, when the time's right? Time is not right. It was definitely not right right now. <sighs> uh, when the time's right, I'd appreciate a chat. Welcome to Slayton Aerospace. Can I help you? I one word down here talking to Nicholas Slayton. I'm afraid Mr. Slayton is a very... No, he isn't. We weren't expecting a VIP to come through. Maybe I could squeeze you in. Oh, I think we can make an exception in your case. Mr. Slayton will see you. Different elevator, I guess, but I figured. Tee hee. We'll find the way up. I'm worried about that. This clearly isn't the executive level. He's on to us. Walter, uh, taking what's mine, then breaking into my. You were gonna starve. I'm sorry. A bold move, but one easily countered. Oh, we're trapped. Hello, Walter. Here, are you there? Lisa. Took longer than I'd like, but I managed to pay off one of Slayton's security consultants. They've patched me in. All right. We've got her out. Once the door's open, just follow her instructions, okay? Well, if my wife and I could gallantly offer your majesty a rescue from certain death, let's go. Doors will open in three... Who in here is having so much fun, man? Around unnoticed. There's a cover just to the right of the elevator you came in on. 
And I'll take my armor off just in case. I don't know if the helmet counts, but there you go. Walter, don't need you don't need to do a 360 Walter. Drop down and follow the conduit all the way to the end, past the fork. There's a vent above you. Just climb up. The room below you is clear. Drop down. Digipix we are, let's go. I need y'all to move. Almost there. Door on the right. There's the door. It should take you outside. Outside? You expect us to climb up the trade tower? There's a series of catwalks that lead directly up one floor to the executive level. Well, I guess after you. Thank you. Oh, I thought it would be the like outside, outside. There's one more door. <laughs> oh, you just want to fight there, Samuel? Do that suppress or a, a stealth gun or a non lethal gun if you're in a bed. I hate not having him wear armor. <laughs> you want to do stealth? So dumb. You're 
We're coming in just behind the executive elevators. I'll call the one on the far end, and you can walk right over the top. You know, it's moments like this that really makes Neon the best place to do business. You steal what's mine. I trap you in the city. You infiltrate my office. I lock it down. Where else can you match wits for the highest stakes but here? <laughs> Aren't you? In the back of your mind, through the tunnel vision of adrenaline. You gotta pay like seven severance packages out, man. That belongs here. It happens to all of us. You have what's mine. I, indirectly, have what's yours. We are at a stalemate. Although, I do count a few more guns on my side. Hmm. You do make a bold point, but that doesn't resolve our current dilemma. Perhaps I can help. We're both people of business, Nicholas. In the same industry, no less. Yes, I'm beginning to see the opportunity. There is, however, one final detail to disclose. Mr. Musgrove, my former employee, and the thief responsible for our serendipitous meeting, was caught prior to your arrival. I think... It would cement our new partnership if you were to decide on his sentence yourselves. I yield to your judgment. You've more than proven yourself capable of resisting any course of action I attempt to dictate to you. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> so execution seems excessive. My security brought Musgrove to my office. I'm sure seeing an opportunity to spare a moment we talk. I know he probably wouldn't do the same. Oh no. You Slayton really does have a sick sense of humor. Please, I was just trying to sell a product, okay? Isn't that why we're all here? Be lenient. We were taking advantage of his initiative, after all, even if we have found ourselves working with the man he stole from. I... A rare moment of compassion for this city. Very well. I'll clear... Then we just wasted 20 minutes. <laughs> You're free to go. Really nothing. Walter, talk to me. Then I think we're just leaving, going to my ship. Yeah, go to the ship. Get going. Mr. Slayton is done with you. Hoping to get a meeting? Be careful if you run into those ecliptic turtles. Is he challenging my life? Are you, I spent so much time sprinting, I probably should do it. So. Are you actually here? Are we going to go into like a different planet or whatever?
Huh. That's... I don't want to be no thief. Is it going up? Do I need to use all my CO2 as well? No. Hmm. <sighs> Because everything you've heard was true. Take it easy. Just another. You look like you could. You'll keep this up. We'll both be living lodge. We're leaving, Walter. Don't count on you. Calm down, Walty. Is this slash marker time? I'm gonna get a drink. I'll be right back. <laughs> 